key corresponding to the function options on the i6s programmer screen. The right function options correspond to the right key. The left options to the left key. The middle options to the OK key. Enter web i2c123.com. Change language to English. Click download to download the i2c mobile phone repair assistant platform. Unzip the installation package to install the i2c platform on the computer. Attention! Before install the I2C platform, must exit or antivirus software on your computer, or it will install fail. Open the I2C platform. Change the language to English. Click register to register email or phone number as your own login account. Login your account to enter the I2C platform. Click driver installation to install the CH340 driver. If install failed, please uninstall it first, then install the CH340 driver again. Using a 5V to a data cable, connect the i6s programmer to the computer. I6S Programmer Interset. Select Wi Fi setting. On the computer, click Connect. Click Refresh. Choose a Wi Fi to enter password. The I6S Programmer will connect with Wi Fi. Attention, I6S Programmer only can connect the Wi Fi LAN in English or numbers. Why click Connect? There is a pop up on computer. Install a Trueton repair board on the device. It will jump to the function automatically. Click Connect to enter Trueton repair function page. Install a Dot Matrix Face ID repair board on device. I6S programmer will jump to Face function page automatically. Click Connect on computer will enter a Face ID repair function page. If you didn't enter any option on the i6s programmer, when you click connector on the computer, we'll have a reminder pop up tips. Then enter an option on the i6s manually, click connector on the computer to enter the function page. Click upgrade to choose a latest version to upgrade the i6s programmer. How to solve the problem that during the upgrade, the data cable was accidentally disconnected from the i6s programmer. The device upgrade failed. First, connect the data cable to the i6s programmer again. Second, close the i2c platform. Then login to open the I2C platform again. Click Upgrade to upgrade the I6S programmer to the latest version to start the I2C programmer.